uh, sometimes with uh, underage chicks. Are you sick, sick young man? man? You're sick. Stop looking at me strangely. I'm tempted to beat a lesson into you, young man. I imagine you are, you catamite. Come here. I'm going to give you the spanking of your life, you little dork. You're going to learn some respect. No, please. I'm I'm here, you. No. No. How you doing? Good. Thank you very much. <laughs> good. Yes, comrade, I am doing good. There is no I, there is only we. <laughs> it is a glorious system, comrade. <laughs> excuse me? You're excused, comrade. You're excused. Now go and mind self for 50 years. <laughs> You're a dick. I'm a rich dick, friend. I'm young and rich and loaded. Tell you what, a hundred bucks on Uncle Sam. Benjamin motherfucking Franklin. Freedom! This coke is okay. Thousands of years people have treated themselves when they got sick. The wisdom was handed down from family to family, mother to daughter, father to son, and sometimes while inebriated, father to daughter. But nobody talked about it. Now we have Come on, Patty. Forget about this fat sir. Lads, shut up. But he's a sir, and you're a comfort. Uh, talking about serves. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Rome? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your damn cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous, this guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's snow in the country. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. <laughs> hey. <laughs> About time. Vlad, Vladdy boy, what's going on? Roman, Roman boy, you tell me what's going on. Nice aftershave, what is that, sex pest? <laughs> no, it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it, I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer. So it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with him. Broke Darden's arm, then beat up a couple more. Then we teach them a real lesson. <laughs> Is that so? I tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. Sure. <laughs> Good. Why not? Later, Vlad. What? The phone's ringing. Hey! Yeah. Okay. No, I, I can't do it. My cousin will do it. Yes, he can drive. No, he's not a cop. His name is Nico. You'll be right over. Nico, sorry to ask, cousin. Can you go pick up Jermaine, one of my regulars? He's over on Rotterdam Hill on Mohawk Avenue? Whatever. What was this all about? Nico came in looking for you, and Vlad told him to get him a fucking coffee, and Nico didn't want to. Coffee? What was he thinking? I know. Этот бит с ними, добавь скорость, uh -huh. долой speed limit. Добавь скорость, добавь скорость. Uh -huh. I 
gift I learned roaming the streets of Eastern Europe back in March. Thanks for coming! Can you take me over to Masterson Street? Masterson Street it is, Jermaine. I thought Roman was gonna pick me up. I need someone I can trust for this run. I'm Roman's cousin. If you can trust him, you can trust me. Ah, uh, he told me about you. You're Nico, right? The hotshot ladies' man cruising around the Mediterranean, breaking hearts and making millions? Yeah, I traded in the yacht for this cab. <laughs> That's exactly the kind of bullshit I can imagine Roman making up. You've got to give him credit for his imagination. Yeah, you got him. I had a feeling you sounded too good to be true. The question is, are you willing to get your hands dirty? My hands haven't been clean for a long time. Being here in Liberty City is just making them dirtier. Okay, okay. I gotta pick up some hot parts for my locker. You down? I ain't got no problem with that. Just don't tell me if you stole this shit from a hospital or a school for sick kids. My conscience is troubled enough already. It's not Rosa, is it? Uh, no, it's Martina. I knew it was not Rosa. This was the name that of the... That door isn't meant to be open. Wait here while I take a look. That was my next guess. The spirits were telling me both. No, wait. Martina... The cops are on to me! Get us out of here! Rosa. That's where that was coming from. Oh, my God. I'm spinning out, man! Get these cops off our tails! I ain't going down, man. Get rid of this heat. There is a man with bad teeth and dirty hair who has just ruminated on you. I think you always sort of knew this. No, wait. Roman's not gonna like that. I'm going to hazard a guess. Your great, great grandmother is dead. Yes, how did you know? I'm just a the spirits oh, speak clearly. She's telling me something. Something about diamonds and true love. Oh, that's great! Oh my gosh, I'm gonna marry a really rich guy! He's gonna wear lots of diamonds! Alright. I don't think they know where we are. Don't attract any unnecessary attention. Have you got another credit card? The spirit great. is telling me We that. lost it. But spirits so what brings you to Liberty City, Nico? Roman, I guess. And some other things. I'm looking for something. Good luck finding them. How's the hunt been going so far? It is not really started yet. I'm getting settled in, you know. Roman has had some issues with loan sharks that needed to be resolved. There's this asshole called Vlad, who he owes money to as well. Good luck with that. Now, $500 sounds like a lot of money. But apparently this true love guy has a lot of diamonds. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Keep looking after Roman, all right? Don't stop there! I think you will meet him. You should join an online dating service. Sleep with many men. Therein lies your prince. That's great! He's not for you. His name? Albert? Roman, I got your friend Jermaine where he wanted to go. Yes, yes, Good, Nico, thanks. I can talk. See you soon. He had a brother called Albert. A brother he doesn't know about. This explains why his life will be marred by failure. Oh, 